Okay, I just want to start by uh, saying I appreciate everybody being here today and um, talk a little bit about the end of fall camp. But obviously, there's something uh, I want to take a few moments, an important situation to discuss with you. So earlier this year, I uh, became aware of a uh, potential NCAA recruiting violation uh, in our program. And the issue involved the communication with the player uh, and his family uh, prior to them entering the portal, the player entering the portal. We spent the past uh, several months cooperating with the NCAA and, you know, uh, reviewed the matter. And based on those discussions, uh, the communication has been determined to be a potential uh, level two NCAA violation. So therefore, I've made the decision in conjunction with uh, the athletic director to recommend a self-imposed one-game suspension uh, and also including one week, a loss of one week off-campus recruiting. I will not be coaching in the season opening game next week against Illinois State, uh, nor will John Budmeyer, receiver coach John Budmeyer. So we'll both serve that suspension. I shared this information with our staff and players this morning and uh, the families of our players this afternoon. And I think it's important uh, to, you know, that I be here today to visit with you. That was the plan. And I uh, also wanted the fans to hear this from me as well. And just uh, want to preface comments by saying because this process is ongoing, there's very little I can give in terms of detail. And uh, we'll do our best there, but not, not much we can say. But the bottom line is this. I, I tell our players, you know, we abide by the rules. And in this specific case, I did not do that. I made a mistake during the recruiting process. I want to apologize to our players, coaching staff, university leadership, and our incredible fans. Uh, 26 years as a head coach. This is the first uh, potential level two violation that I've had, and it won't happen again. It's my plan to coach the team during the week. And uh, as of midnight next uh, Friday, uh, I'll be removed for 24 hours. Won't be in the stadium with them. And, um, you know, so that, that's the plan. Seth Wallace will be the acting head coach during the, uh, during the day next week, Saturday. And I'm confident he and uh, the entire staff will do a great job on that. Again, there aren't many details that we can really share, unfortunately, until this matter is closed. Uh, but I did feel it was important to stand up in front of all of you and acknowledge uh, when I had done something wrong. You know, basically you face the repercussions. And then we'll move forward with our season. And that's our plan at this point. So that being said, I just want to take this opportunity to ask uh, Beth to say a few words. Thank you. 